What's up guys? Today I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, do another update video for you guys. I think clutch number, I think it's clutch number eight uh, just finally dropped. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull the female out of the eggs, count the eggs, um, make sure everything's healthy, put them in the incubating tub and uh, share with you guys that pairing. So stay tuned and let's get this video started. So this is the female, uh, she just laid today, uh, probably, I don't know, anywhere, sometime today. I checked on her early this morning around, um, I believe around 10.30, 11 o'clock, and she hasn't laid yet. Um, so this uh, just happened uh, later this afternoon. So we we'll wanna go ahead and just get the eggs, uh, put in the incubating tub, remove her, get her cleaned up, and put her in the new, her new tub uh, with clean uh, bedding and everything so that she can uh, get back to eating right away. So let me go ahead and get her out and uh, let's get this one uh, excited to, it's always exciting to see these eggs, these mamas coiled up into their clutches, so. All right, so let me just dump this water. Make sure she doesn't and grab her incubating tub. Let's see here. Uh, I don't remember how many eggs I paid from her, but looks like she's got a couple of slugs. Maybe I didn't uh, pay her enough, uh, who knows. Uh, she went with a proven breeder male that has produced some great, um, but I think, let me go ahead and put her somewhere. She doesn't want to. All right, come on girl. And from the looks of it, she is, she is good. So she's pretty empty. So that's, that's a clutch right there. Uh, so that is so far two, four, six eggs, two slugs. So that's a total of eight. Um, unfortunate, but sometimes it does happen. So let me go ahead and start pulling this one two three and these ones are no good no bueno here There you go. So that is a beautiful clutch. Um, you know, I looking from her records, I did pair her one, two, three, four. I mean, I paired her four times that had a visual lock. So uh, maybe I didn't pair her. I did start pairing her a lot earlier because she was already, um, she was huge. So. Uh, it might be uh, I didn't pair her enough during the later part of uh, of the building uh, follicles process. Who knows? Um, but you know, so far, you know, two slugs. Uh, but I'll take six good eggs, then uh, then uh, nothing at all. So let me see if I can um, dim the lights and palpate this. Uh, I mean, not palpate, but uh, uh, candle these these eggs. Where is my, ah, there it is. So let me go ahead and shut the lights off. Oh, the female didn't go in where it's supposed to. So let me pause so this. I got the female secured. Let me turn off the lights and get these, get these guys 
that's a good vein right there. Oh yeah, that's perfect. That's perfect. That's good. That's good. So this one, if you look at it, that one's good. You can see the veins up top, but this one looks like it's upside down. So I'm gonna have to rotate that. Um, let's see. completely upside down so now there you go the veins are up top this one the veins are up top I think uh, let me see I might have to rotate that one there you go That's good. This one's pretty good. That one's good. That's good. So let me go ahead and turn on the lights. A little bit of settling here, but I think those good. Those ones are pretty good. So two, four, six eggs, uh, and I'll show you guys um, the. I'm gonna go wash the female. I'll show you guys the female again, and then uh, I'll show you guys the, the male. So let me go ahead and uh, put these uh, eggs away and then uh, we'll get back. So she's probably not gonna be that cooperative uh, because she just wants to get away. Um, and Or maybe she's probably looking for her eggs. Um, but this is a pastel champagne. So she's a big mama. Um, just got her cleaned up. Um, I just cleaned up a prepared a new tub for her, but um, you know, I palpated her. She looks she feels empty Nothing stuck there, but uh, this girl is is uh, Gorgeous lots of yellows with that little head stamp right there a little ringer at the end But this is a pastel champagne uh, Female and I'll show you guys the male that I've uh, paired her with so Give me a second, let me put her away, and uh, I'll show you guys the, the, the male. Okay, so this is the male that I paired her with. Uh, this is an uh, ALS or Act Like Super uh, combo. Uh, I have proven him to be Enchi, and I've uh, actually recently posted a, a picture of him breeding uh, a female on uh, Instagram. But this is a Crystal Enchi. Uh, and a crystal is uh, Mojave and special. So uh, anything that uh, he will produce with her would be at least an Enchi or at least a Mojave. Um, he can't pass on both genes, so I cannot make any more crystals or just like him uh, with this pairing. But the reason why I paired this is because Billy from Mutation Creation, I've seen some combos he made with some champagne specials. Uh, the special does put back um, some pattern into the champagne, so, and then also with the Enchi, I'm hoping that uh, a, pa um, a champagne Enchi special would have a lot more uh, pattern to them. Uh, as you know, uh, champagne is a, a very dominant combo where it really just washes all the patterns away, but Leopard, Enchi, and the special for some reason puts back those um, um and uh puts back the pattern and uh, an unlikely combo with a special i didn't realize it would put back some some uh, some pattern to the snake so to the champagne so uh hoping for some uh, some babies i we have six eggs six good eggs with strong veins so at least uh, maybe i'm hoping for at least one uh champagne sh uh, champagne special enchi or even just a champagne uh, special would uh, would definitely be a good good one to hold back and keep. So, but this boy is a stud breeder. He's I mean he locks with anyone, um, and he's a gorgeous boy. So I wanted to share him and feature him in this video. So, um, but yeah, that's it. So just that's just the update uh, that I wanted to show you guys. Um, I, I have one uh, one more female that should be laying anytime soon. I actually have her dated to lay sooner than the pastel champagne, but she hasn't. Uh, so I'll check tomorrow morning. Most likely she'll probably lay in a couple of days. So, 
But um, that's it. If you guys have any questions on the pairing or uh, available animals, do comment down below or uh, click on my social media uh, links and message me there for faster response. Um, it's hard to communicate on YouTube comments. So uh, if you guys want to, you can either text me, DM me or PM me uh, on Facebook. Um, and we do have this new uh, social media because Facebook is phasing out a lot of these websites uh, that's selling animals. So um, uh, MeWe, I think. I uh, just signed up on that, so you just look me up on MeWe. I'll, I'll put a link to on the description, but it's just really my name, uh, Trig Reptiles, uh, and you guys can go ahead and uh, find me there. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this update. Uh, you guys, uh, hopefully, you enjoyed the snakes that I've shown. If you guys have any requests on videos, um, snakes you guys want to see, um, or just maybe pictures you guys want to me to send you directly. Uh, definitely uh, message me and uh, I'll, I'll be glad to share that with you guys. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. Till next time.